Today in this video, we will be discussing 4th Stimulus Check Update 2023. This one is a much awaited topic. 4th Stimulus Check specifically focused on social security including retirement, disability, SSDI, survivors, SSI, VA, RRB and low income, no income seniors. Also older adults, people with disabilities. I have got all the details right here in this video. All the information you need to know. Also today in this video, we will be discussing the schedule for the social security benefits for all the social security beneficiaries so without further ado let's get right into all the details all right guys now there are lots of people lot of people right here into the community ask me this very important question is there any latest update regarding a fourth stimulus check what's really going on many of you right here in the community are basically wondering when are we going to receive fourth stimulus check is there any latest update how much the money will be and when will i get those however guys before we deep dive into all the details make sure to subscribe to our channel how to guys turn on all the bell notification and do check out other videos from our channel be sure to hit that like share this video and without further ado let's get right into all the details all right guys so first i wanted to address the most common question that i receive in the comment section pretty much every day many of you right here in the community are wondering about the latest updates onto the fourth stimulus check whether it has been approved who is eligible to receive this fourth stimulus check and how much it will be what will be the fourth stimulus check amount and when will i get the fourth stimulus check these are some important questions i get in the comment section now if you take a look at the economy guys things are changing pretty rapidly i wanted to highlight some of the super important things uh you know what here into the economy things are changing rapidly so we need to keep close eye on to these important aspects because you know what these will totally decide whether the fourth stimulus check is coming or not now over the last few weeks i have seen some of the weird updates from various sources including some inflation reports data interest rates from federal reserves massive layoffs from big companies and these are some weird situation i noticed also the unemployment rate is a crucial factor that we need to watch very very closely when it comes down to those additional stimulus measures and you know what during the economic cycles we witness periods of economic growth and expansion followed by the contractions or recessions now when we experience a recession or economic contraction well guess what the government usually intervenes and gives out and send us a stimulus check to stimulate the economy by providing the financial assistance to individuals and businesses. Therefore, the unemployment rate and the jobs market status are essential indicators which government uses to access the economic health of the country. Basically, government see those as indicators whether the economy country needs additional stimulus money or not. Now, moving forward, let's move on to the social security and how much it will be impacted by the fourth stimulus check. And we are talking about seniors retirees and disabled individuals who receive their benefits from the social security and this one including people on retirement disability ssdi survivors ssi va rrb also no income low income seniors older adults and people with disabilities basically those are the people who are hit hard by the pandemic many of these individuals are struggling to make their end meets right now simply to pay out their bills put food onto the table even to afford the basic necessities cities while you know what a fourth stimulus check is not guaranteed at this point there are other measures that government might be taking to provide assistance to the vulnerable groups for example they could increase the social security benefit amount also they can expand the eligibility criteria or introduce additional programs and incentives which are aimed at helping seniors disabled individuals and low-income families like i said guys i said we need to watch some economic indicators we need to watch very very closely to understand understand the possibility of another stimulus check which is being approved or not now i know guys some of you may find this information a bit of overwhelming but you know what it's essential to understand that when it comes down to the fourth stimulus check we need to watch out for these key important factors unfortunately we just can't write a letter or make a phone call to the congress and just ask them for a stimulus checks just send us a fourth stimulus check make a request they don't make any sort of a decision based on our pleas or how much we are struggling instead them do make their decisions based on the state of economy and its activity and that's why it's so important to keep close eye on the economic indicators that show whether we are heading towards an economic recession and a significant economic contraction is happening or not now if that is the case let's say we are heading towards an recession or significant economic contraction then guys we can expect there will be another stimulus check however we can't say for sure whether it will be two thousand dollars check or one thousand 
$400 stimulus check. You know what? Many people have asked me about this very important question. What is really happening regarding that $2,000 stimulus check petition? While it's a nice gesture that couple of millions of signatures have already got onto that $2,000 stimulus check petition. But in reality, guys, it won't actually influence Congress decisions. And if it really did, then in that scenario, they would have approved ongoing $2,000 stimulus check a year or two years ago when those stimulus check was much needed in hard times just a couple of years ago in the pandemic. Now, just to be clear on to the poor stimulus check, whether it has been approved or not, guys, let me tell you a federal level poor stimulus check has not been approved currently as of right now. I'm doing this video, so make sure you note this fact. All right, guys, so let's start discussing the social security benefit payment schedule. Now, let me show you the exact benefits for the July and August. Let's discover all the key dates starting with the July schedule. There are few dates still remaining. So we are talking about those group of people whose birthday lasts between 21st to 31st of the month. Then be sure to check out 26th of the July for your fixed income benefits to be deposited in your bank account. Now moving forward, let's discuss the August schedule. Knowing these benefit issuance dates allows the beneficiaries to plan their finances and ensure they can meet their financial obligation without any uncertainties. First, let's talk about the supplemental security income schedule. The beneficiaries of supplemental security income do not fall into the previous month schedule since they receive their money during the first days of the month. This is regardless of their birthday. Now, the amount for the retired worker depend on the situation of each person. The monthly average is about $1,801 according to SSA's calculation and with the possibility of collecting up to $4,555 as the maximum benefit for the year 2023. Now let's talk about the August 2023 Social Security SSI SSDI Fixed Income Beneficiaries Payment Schedule. All the Supplemental Security Income SSI beneficiaries typically receive their payment on first of each and every month. But sometimes how simply the dates are lying onto the calendar, first of the month happens to be landing on holiday, weekend and in that scenario your payments may be shifted one or two days early. But that's not the case happening into the August instead you'll be going to get your payments on a timely manner so be sure to check out first of the August 2023 for your social security supplemental security income to be deposited in your direct express card checks mails or bank account next important date is the 3rd of the August 3rd of the August is for those group of beneficiaries if you have received your social security before May 1997 or somebody receiving both social security and SSI payment together be sure to check out 3rd of the August for your social security payment to be deposited and check out your SSI payment to be deposited on 1st of the August. All right, guys, moving forward, the next important date we got is actually six days later, which is a 9th of the August 2023. From right over here, we are talking about all those group of beneficiaries typically receive their payment based on their birth date. All right, so first group of recipient would typically get their payment whose birth date falls between 1st to 10th of the month. So if your birth date lies between 1st to 10th of the month, be sure to check out the second Wednesday that is the 9th of the August 2023. Be sure to check out direct express card checks, mails or your bank accounts. All right guys then moving forward we got the next important date exactly a week later. All right this is when the 16th of the August very important date comes in handy. If you are those group of beneficiaries whose birth date falls between 11 to 20th of the month then be sure to check out 16th of the August for your benefits to be deposited in your direct express card checks, mails or bank accounts. All right, guys, then moving forward, we got the next important date, which is 23rd of the August 2023. Now, who will be going to receive their payment on 23rd of the August? Well, if you are those group of beneficiaries who typically receive their payment on 26th of the August, if your birth date falls between 21st to 31st of the month, those group of beneficiaries typically get their payment on 4th Wednesday. Once again, I checked it, 4th Wednesday in the August is a completely normal day, no weekend, no holiday. So be sure to check out 26th of the August if your birth date falls between 21st to 31st of the month. I hope you found this video helpful. Make sure to hit that like, share this video, subscribe to our channel, do check out other videos and this is Kedar from How to Guys signing out.